The HQ-16 is a medium-range surface to MSR developed by the People's Republic of China. This sophisticated MSR system derived from the earlier versions of the Russian Berg missile system represents a significant advancement in China's air defense capabilities. Development of the HQ-16 began in 2005, reportedly with assistance from the Armors Anti Corporation, a prominent Russian defense contractor. Initially conceived as a naval defense system, the project culminated in late 2011 when China announced the completion of the co-development between Russia and China of the MISA. This period also saw the development of the HQ-16B variant. A typical HQ-16 ground battery consists of a command post, two multifunction radars, and four to six launchers with each launcher housing six missiles. The system boasts an effective combat altitude range of 100 to 20,000 meters and a rapid response time of 6 to 8 seconds. Impressively, an HQ-16 battery can simultaneously engage up to 8 air defense with a single shot kill probability of 0.9. This high success rate is attributed to the system's advanced vertical launch technology, phase array radar, and composite guided grass. The system's mobility is enhanced by self-propelled launch vehicles. Designed to bridge the gap between the short-range HQ-7 and the long-range HQ-9 surface to MSR systems, the HQ-16 excels in intercepting both high-altitude aerial targets and very low-flying targets at distances up to 40 km. This versatility ensures comprehensive air defense coverage across various threat spectrums. The naval version of the HQ-16, known as the HQ-16, is deployed on Type 054A frigates and can intercept sea skimming missiles flying less than 10 meters above the sea surface. The HQ-16 utilizes a vertical launch system similar to Western designs, specifically the HAKJ-16VLS, which includes 32 missile cells. The missile itself is based on the Soviet 9M317ME Steel-1 missile, and the naval and land-based missiles are reportedly interchangeable. Target acquisition for the HQ-16 is conducted by the ship's main air search radar with the Type 345 fire control radars used for target illumination. H each HQ-16 equipped vessel is fitted with four Type 345 radars, enabling the simultaneous engagement of multiple targets. Depending on the threat level, one or two missiles may be fired at a single target. Two variants of the HQ-16 missile are currently in use. The HQ-16A and the HQ-16B. The HQ-16A has a maximum range of 40 km and can reach altitudes up to 18 km. The longer range HQ-16B extends the engagement envelope to 60 to 70 km and altitudes between 21 and 25 km. These missiles are effective against aircraft, helicopters, and missiles providing robust point defense against inbound, anti-ship, and cruise missiles. To date, the HQ-16 system is exclusively employed by the Chinese People's Liberation Army Navy. Over 30 systems have been acquired and are operational on the 30 Type 054A class frigates and are refitted Type 051 class destroyer. Given the export of the land-based HQ-16 to Pakistan, 
it is likely that the Naver variant were also available for international markets in the future. In conclusion, the HQ-16 surface to MSR system represents a significant leap in China's air defense technology. Its versatile and robust capabilities provide comprehensive protection against a wide range of aerial threats, making it a critical component of China's defense strategy. With both land-based and naval variants, the HQ-16 ensures China's air defense remains flexible and formidable in various operational environments.